Hi, everyone. My name is Segan Park, and I am leader of engineering program management team at Samsung Biologics. COVID-19 had a global impact across the industry and pharmaceutical biotech industry is one that went through the most significant change and evaluation. Many breakthrough vaccine and therapies have been discovered and each outsourcing CDMO demand is increasing dramatically. CDMO players are preparing themselves for such emerging trend and growing market demand. So this session at DC80 would be perfect timing and opportunity to review the future outlook of their expansion. Thank you for joining me today. And I would like to share with you an information about our recent public announcement of Samsung Biology's brand new plan, plan for, which is will deliver success to our client through flexible capability as well as accumulate know-how. To prepare for the continued growth of biopharma market, we are building plan for as being in the pharmaceutical industry. We need more development and manufacturing capability to keep pace with the astounding growth of demand that has caused due to the unexpected events such as a pandemic or emerging MAP platform-based therapies for conditions such as Alzheimer's and various cancers. According to multiple sources, including the FDA biologics market has more than doubled in the last 10 years and is expected to double again in only the next five. In terms of volume of the therapeutic antibody products, it has tripled in the last 10 years. A current survey showed that 59% of pharma companies has existing partner with the CDMO to meet the explosive demand for biologics. This is why Samsung Biology is continuously investing to expand our facility. Samsung Biologics is building to future of biopharma. Located at our existing site in the Songdo, Incheon, South Korea. We invest 1.47 billion US dollars on the construction of our fourth plan. The total floor area of the plan floor will be 238,000 square meters, which is equivalent to the combined floor area of the existing three plan. Also, plan four will add in 256 k liter bioreactor capacity to the our existing 364k liter capacity, which in total will become 620k liter of total manufacturing capacity. The construction of the fourth plan also contributed to the society as we will hire 1,800 more employees to operate this new plant with 6,400 additional construction workers. Starting with the construction of the first plant in 2011, we have built three plants smoothly so far in Songdo, South Korea. The picture below shows the filing and foundation of plant four that is currently under construction. Upon completion of plant four, Samsung Biologics will offer the combined sum of 620,000 liters, all from a single site. As an integrated CDMO service provider, our rapid growth began with Plan 1, which introduced our ingenuity, uh, followed by Plan 2, which demonstrated our scale-up potential. And most recently, Plan 3, made us global force with the largest capacity at, at the single site. Also, when Plan 4 is constructed, we will have total four 1K bioreactor, including two single-use bioreactors, six 5K liter bioreactors, six 10K liter bioreactors, and sort of four 15K liter bioreactors. And now with even greater global demand for not only share capability, but also flexible scale, our force super plant will bring the best of our first three plants under one loop. 
in addition to the largest state of, of art innovation to provide a wide breadth of solution for our clients. As we are aware of the current biopharmer trend with better productivity and biotechnology, our emphasis is on to the operating multi-scale bioreactor to meet the various requirements of our client. Designed to scale to the varying needs of clients from large-scale commercial manufacturing to critical manufacturing. Plan 4 will be the most flexible one to date with a diverse lineup of bioreactor ranging from 10 k liter and 15 k liter. Also, there's something more to being the largest bio manufacturing facility. It is an economy of scale where production become efficient for maximum output to uh, benefit you and your patient behind. Not only the brand new plant offers a flexibility in scale, we will also deliver a complete end-to-end -end full integrated one-stop CDMO solution at a single facility. The plan for will provide a full range of CDO, CMO, and bioanalytical service to offer a complete one-stop service, including early stage development. Clinical supply, large-scale commercial manufacturing, labeling and packaging capability with a full QC lab, including in-house biosafety testing capabilities. Also, we plan to implement automation and latest biomanufacturing technologies to operate agility at the highest quality. We have groundbreaking in October 2020, last year. Since October 2020, 10K liter bioreactors will be operational by full CGMP ready by the fourth quarter of 2022 and 15K liter bioreactor will be in full CGMP ready by the first quarter of 2023. As we implemented a modular design model for plan four. With the completion of plan four, we will achieve the world's largest capability at the single site within only 36 months. With the plan for, we are going to shatter our own record by adding another 256 k liter capability for total site capacity of 620 k liter. For the next decade and beyond, we will build on this expansion to deliver the future of biopharma manufacturing process we have come to know and expect of Samsung Biologics. Thank you.